Who's ready for a pre-show tag team match? Well, here we are. It's the season finale. Second City Showdown 2 Stampede, and this is the pre-show. This is Welcome November. Welcome to the beginning of the end. The end. November the 18th, 2022. From the Bayou, with a combined weight of 350 pounds of red beans and rice, they are the team of Bayou Bill. So are these are both of these athletes from the Bayou, and do they really weigh red beans and rice weight? Look at them. How much does red beans and rice weigh specifically? Usually they weigh a few ounces, but judging by the looks of things. The team of Michael, the Vice Grip Gonzalez, and the Lizard Man. The Lizard Man? He does look like something to call on the Nile. What have we here? This is my favorite part. You get to see these young superstars as they hone their craft because you know one day they will be main event people at some point. It's a it's a, it's a, a preview of what's to come. We've seen it multiple times. It's beautiful. Not you're beautiful, it's beautiful. I know. We man. have a damn monitor, it's right here, I can see everything. There is no excuse now. No, that's, see that's the thing I keep wrapping my head around. Now I, if I suck, then I suck and I can't blame the fact that I can't see. You most certainly do not. Now I can blame my eyesight because I'm old. So I, I still have it in my pocket. And Turtle rings the bell and we are underway well, the season finale. He signaled for the ringing of the bell. All right, he signaled, the he bell was rung. Stop be stop semanticing, semanticing me. Sure. All right, so. Collar and elbow tie up. And Michael the Vice Grip Gonzalez is buying for control. You gotta watch out Didn't for Bayou Bill. Well, he's born on the you. He is a crafty individual, and he has showcased himself well at the Futures Royal repeatedly. Very much so. Incidentally, what number of Futures Royal are we on there, Stan? We are going to have our, provided the world does not end after this match, the uh, 47th Futures Division Battle Royale on this, the 18th day of November, on a frigid night late in 2022. The last time we had a show was a nice, balmy 87 degrees. Oh my God, what a shoulder tackle by Gonzalez. He hit him like a semi-truck. That vice grip is as cold as it is as outside as he's hip tossed. Now you Bill got some air under that hip toss too. Yeah. A slam. I think he made Bayou angry. See, I keep looking into the ring, and I have this monitor right here. It is rather new. Bayou Bill is swung around by Michael. Nice group comes out. And the cover! Ooh, that was close. Turtle right where he needs to be, always in the right position. You know, this is like watching CSW on television, which we totally should be. Most people are. It's a televised event. On the internet. And now the lizard man is in the ring. Wait, what 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 do you, we have here? Uh, oh, that's Claus Loco. But it's isn't it Abuelo? Abuel Abuelito. 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 He's the Abuelito. I knew there was a, I knew there was an A word in there. And right now Bayou Bill has got the lizard man. And he is delivering the punishment. Claus Loco is bringing presents for the fans. As... Tilt-a-whirl slam! If you can call it that, that's kind of what it looked like. It had resemblance to the Falcon Air. Oh, my! Bayou Bill just kicked his partner's face off. And Nathan Nile, the man. Drop kicks. And Niles tap. The Gons is in, and the Gons has a look of of irritation on his, oh, oh my God! He shot out of that ring like a damn cannon! Like a blessing, man. Gonzo and Lizard, man, I like this team! Great 
short arm clothesline by Michael Gonzalez. Gonzo has got the attention. Oh my God! Another short arm. Well, that'll that'll disturb your lunch, that's for sure. And the fans are getting a little restless here at the pre-show. And that is how you do that. Good angle, God! Beautiful angle slam. He almost broke him in half with a cover. He did it. See you in 2023, Gonzo. Good God! Nathan Nile is collecting himself after he flew literally eight feet, Stan Payne. Literally. And the Gonzo chant rocking and, um, what is it, Loco Claus or Claus Loco? Claus Loco, the grandfather of Abuelito. Abuelito. And Primo Claus. Primo Loco. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, it's the, it's the ice pick. What the? Why is the ice pick in the face of Gonzo? What is happening right now? Vic McCree has been gone for a minute. He could, what a, that's a hell of a time to come back. Yeah. And why Gonzo? Oh. Are we already? But I have noticed some market. No doubt, no doubt. The vice, vice grip and the ice pick. Coincidence? I think not. Not anymore. Oh, we're getting the thumbs up from Xavier. That sexy animal. That guy. We got Xavier, look at Xavier and Derek working together, doing the, eight. oh, here comes Wade. This is great. Juicy, the camera man. Yep. And here come all the, here come the two refs. There's two of them. The turtle and Kevin Woods. Kevin Woods who won the Battle Royale, which is the new Battle Royale five times. The great Theseus comes out. Ladies and there. gentlemen, here comes the future. There's Pistolero. Pakistani rock star, Ahmad Khan. Hispanic ace, Macho Garcia. Hey, it's Big John! Big and bad, John McNasty. John McNasty and those guns. And we got the Crimson Bolt is back. Lee Metallic is back. Lee Metallic returns. King Trell. There's Gambling Connor Gore. John Bonhart. The Superior Chad hired out. And Ref Dev followed everybody out. I guess Ref Dev was pulling up the rear. As long as he wasn't born on the back. No, the body already happened. All right, so we, oh, and here he comes. Eddie the Bruiser Crew. It's CSW favorite. Is there anybody more over than Eddie in the Futures Royal? Yes, the Black Sheep, FXP probably. I, I disagree with you. Eddie giving the high fives to all the fans as they await his arrival. That is a lot of humanity in that ring, Stan Payne. Number 47, we are about to go. Are about to and the bell is rung. And there, and we are, oh, oh, oh. Man. Message sent to Eddie. That is not, that is not gonna go well. That's not very nice. Oh, man. I think Eddie's had enough of that. He gores him into the corner. And now we are underway. Is Claus Loco in the ring now, too? He is. The big, bad John McNasty is delivering forearms and gut-wrenching maneuvers. John McNasty is in great physical condition. That is body by Boz material. Oh, sir. And you can get go, body go by to, Boz Go to Grand well. Avenue, you can have body by Boz, too, except yeah, I don't get to have that. It'd be nice. It would look odd on you, quite frankly. Yeah, yeah, you're right. And any chance are echoing through this another packed house. Everybody wants to see the season finale. Trying to eliminate the green. Yep. 
Oh, he almost eliminated the great Greek Theseus. Theseus who trounced the Minotaur centuries ago. Now delivers a forearm to Estalero, tries to eliminate him. Claus Loco doing some heavy hit. Merry Christmas chopping to John McNasty. And now McNasty is about to return. Oh my! And there is our first elimination of the evening, Great I believe. Greek Theseus. Didn't take a Trojan horse this time, or that was, that's the Romans. I'm sorry. I get, no, no, I get, no, 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 Are we at a John wrestling Bonner. show, or is this the cast John, of Teddy and the Cruiser? Oh! Eliminated. We have got chaos in that ring, as the future Royals usually are. Looks like Lee Metallic has been eliminated. That's or no, speed. no, he's right there. That's speed. Oh, Trell is eliminated. Trell is eliminated. Man, this monitor made Trell look like he was 6'5". I thought he was 6'5". I don't know how I feel about this now. You mean he's not 6'5"? I don't believe so. And the numbers begin to dwindle in the Futures Royal. We will have a winner at some point. Crimson Bolt is in a prone position in the corner of the ring. No. Now Eddie is trying to help uh, Claus Loco. Trying to take out John McNasty. You know, Cypher has won six of these. Cypher is not showing up in this match tonight. You never know, he just pops it out of nowhere. He is, he oh no, oh no! Oh, the ghost of Christmas. Past, present, and future is done. Bad John McNasty stuck with it, and he eliminated Klaus. Lopez. Lee Metallic also eliminated. A shout out to Lee Metallic making his return. You gotta love the heart of that kid. He overcame a lot to come back. Yes. And he is back, and we'll look to see what he does next year. Big Ben. John McNasty is out. Courtesy of Eddie the Bruiser Cruz and the Crimson Bolt. And the crew has a record for the most exciting entrance ever at our last show. Check out the October show, 2020. Pistolero is still in there, as is Chad hired out the superior. Eddie oh, the oh Crimson Bolt! Ooh, is a biscuit away from elimination. Oh no! Oh no, Eddie, no! Don't let it be so! Oh, we got chaos! Pachu Garcia saves Eddie the Bruce Cruz. And there's a hug! We got camaraderie in the Royal! They gotta help each other out. That's good. You learn to develop teamwork in these battle royales, and you also learn when to fight for yourself. And once again, the Crimson Bolt eliminated almost. Oh, well. Hard, hard to eliminate him. He's fending off. Oh, he finally was eliminated. Crimson Bolt. Uh-oh. Don't tell me Cypher's coming. I don't know what happened. We had a technical glitch. But we're back, mercifully. Pancho Garcia is thrown into the superior chat fired off. And we got splashes everywhere. Oh, man. And there are four Family. men left. Family Connor Corn. Chad Hyerdahl are being. Now wait a minute, what happens if those two are the Oh, Eddie dropped the bomb. My goodness. That is a lot of beef on that man. That might be the end. Yeah. And he softened him up and then dispatched him quickly. Macho. Oh, accidentally hit by Cruz. And Eddie is, uh, Eddie, uh oh, Eddie is in no man's land. Oh, no, Eddie. Eddie is in big trouble. He is on the wrong side of the ring, uh, wrong side of the ropes. Eddie a shoe! And Eddie's got him up! Helicopter spin! How are you gonna get up from that? He tried, we've seen him. And the Eddie chants are happening, here we go! And Eddie with a win! He 
did it. He won. And magic number 47 belongs to Eddie the Bruiser, and the crowd is on fire. And this is why, Stan Payne, you don't miss the pre-show because you can't put a price tag on that kind of excitement. You really can. Eddie is throwing candy into the crowd. It's Eddie Claus. As opposed to Claus Loco. Eddie Claus is coming to CSW. Oh, CSW, that's even better. See, I, oh, man. just call me the Weird Al Yankovic of commentary. Actually, never call me that. Yeah, I wasn't going to. But you should. Eddie the Bruiser loving life here at the season finale. Eddie. And 2023 is his oyster. Eddie, you got any halls? 